goes crazy. That, that's what I mean. I don't know, they can have up to one to six little pups and that would be absolutely amazing. So yeah, unfortunately we don't have a waterfall right now. We don't have any water coming through right now. Nothing is pouring, no filtration. It's only been about a day or two. Look at her belly, look at her belly, look at her belly. It's humongous, you guys. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video here at Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch, AKA Bear. You guys probably clicked on here because everybody loves problems in this world and everybody loves drama in this world. So the problem and the drama that we have today here on the ranch is that the pumps inside of the Aquascape ecosystem with the giant viewing panel for Oliver and Callie, the pumps went to and it wasn't Aquascape's fault. I'm gonna explain why in just a few minutes. We're gonna get back over there and we're gonna go show you Oliver and Callie. And we also have some good news, really, really good news. Something that I thought was gonna happen two, three months ago, but it's happening right now. So follow along, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and let me go show you Oliver and Callie and what the bad news is and what the good news is here on the ranch. All right, so going down into our section with our viewing panel with Oliver and Callie, you guys might notice something and you might not hear anything either. So what happened was our pond, the pumps completely went bad. Look at Oliver. Hey, Oliver. How you doing, buddy? So that's Oliver right there. And check out Callie. I don't know if you guys noticed anything, but Callie is a little bit on the heavy side. And there's a reason for that. Can you guys put it down in the comments? So you guys can see the water level is really low. The reason why that water level is low is because both pumps literally exploded. The reason why they exploded is because they're putting all the power lines in our neighborhood underneath the ground and while they've been doing that for the last month they've been doing the whole situation they were about to cut our wire or cut our electricity here on the ranch and when they were going to do that i said whoa 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 hold up reverse this for a second i know you guys are professionals and i know you guys are good at what you guys do but things can happen so please before you guys cut my electricity can you guys put a generator on my property or can you connect a plug from the main electricity to my building, to the back of the property, so that my fish, most importantly, my fish and my incubators don't go out. They said it's only gonna be 15 minutes, but you never know what could happen. Problems happen all the time. And with a problem, it could be cut for more than a few hours. So that would have been obviously a situation and I would have lost all my animals inside the building. None of that happened, thankfully. Why? Because they connected a wire to our meter and it was able to run electricity throughout the whole property. But unfortunately, when that happened, there was a big boom. And when that big boom happened, it shocked some stuff on the property. It could have been a lot worse. We could have lost all our electricity. I don't know what happened. I'm not an electrician. Something must have happened. And what happened was we went around the property when that happened. We checked all the pumps, all the everything on the property to see what's going on. Otter pond, Dunzos. Both pumps went bad, took a crap. All the fans in our property inside the house all went bad. The AC for our dogs went bad our refrigerators in our house went bad as in they got fried everything got fried because of the situation of the big boom with the power going to it thankfully it didn't fry the whole entire property it just fried certain things thankfully as well the people are paying for everything back the company they don't want to get sued obviously so they're paying back all the damages that happened on the ranch so tony from pondscape shout out to tony from pondscape always messaging me back on everything hit him up if you guys need any ponds in South Florida, your cleanings, anything from Aquascape, Pondscape, on YouTube, on Instagram, all that stuff, hit up Tony. If you guys have a situation, call Tony and say, Blake, sent me here. I need some help. Um, called him, got right onto it, got me the invoice and sent it to the company. They got two pumps coming right now, and the pumps are coming really fast. But this door now, I have a pulley system right here for the otters. Ready? There you go. Open it right there. Tie it all the way around. The reason why we have to do that is we have good news. We have this spot here and we have this spot here. We have straw inside of there. This is the good news. That right there is Cali. And Cali, I am pretty sure this time is completely showing. Give me Cali that she is pregnant, you guys. Callie is officially pregnant. She has humongous nipples showing. She's probably right around the corner and her stomach is huge too. Hey, Callie girl, how you doing? You gonna be a good mama? You gonna be a good mama? 
Callie is pregnant, you guys. I repeat, Callie is pregnant and she has a humongous belly on her, which is absolutely amazing. I am so excited about this right now. Let's go bring her outside and I'm gonna show you her belly on what it looks like. So yeah, unfortunately we don't have a waterfall right now. We don't have any water coming through right now. Nothing is pouring, no filtration. It's only been about a day or two, but that is all right. Everything is coming right now and everything is going to get fixed. We got Oliver right there. And then we have Callie. Callie is 100% pregnant, you guys. And I am super, super, super excited about that. We have our nest ready and everything is ready for her to give birth. I think she is just about ready to have her babies too you guys she is very large i think she only has maybe two pups inside of there but that is an awesome accomplishment for aquascape and everybody that made this awesome ecosystem and helped me design this whole entire design for them because it proved that these guys are happy these guys are healthy these guys are breeding and now we might have a proven litter here oliver is acting very very different now because of the fact of his girlfriend's pregnant and he can't breed her so we're not gonna stay in here for too long because I don't want him to latch onto my leg because even though he was hand raised by me, he could be a little spicy sometimes. So we're gonna start coming out of here for right now so we don't mess with them too much. Otters are amazing animals, but sometimes when they become mature, like any animals, they could be a little spicy. So you always have to watch your step, give them their space and all that stuff. So Oliver's inside of here right now. Hey, Oliver. He goes crazy. So if anybody guys were wondering as well, what species of otters we have here on the ranch, they're small called Asian otters. And they're really, really cool ambassadors here on the ranch. We have our viewing panel. That's a four by seven foot viewing panel that we can watch them swim and do their thing and live life. They have fish that's inside of here as well. We have massive giant rocks and all that stuff. And I know a lot of people are probably like, ah, the pond is broken, blah, blah, this and that, but that's all right. It's okay. All right, check out Callie. Look at her belly, look at her belly, look at her belly. It's humongous, you guys. Look at Oliver, 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 Oliver. And this is a good example to see Callie. Look at her boobs right there. Her nipples are absolutely massive. Check her out, they've been playing like crazy, living their best life. He's been checking her out, taking care of her. But I'll tell you guys right now, you guys, Callie is 100% pregnant. She has a humongous ball. Last time when they bred, we did not see that. Nothing showed whatsoever, but this time, there is 100% something growing inside of her. We just brought them to the vet just like three months ago too, and they got their yearly shots. They're 100% healthy. They got their blood work and everything. It must've been right after we brought them to the vet that she became pregnant. So it's really, really exciting. Make sure you give these videos a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and stay tuned. What do you guys think? Is she gonna have one baby, two babies, three babies, four? I don't know. They can have up to one to six little pups, and that would be absolutely amazing. Uh-oh. We got an otter fight going on. Hey, Callie. Here, look, look at her, look at her stomach. Look at that belly, look at that belly, you guys. She looks absolutely amazing. Hey, Callie. Hey, Callie, girl. She has a big old belly, you guys. So, bad news, our pumps and waterfalls are broken right now, but it was nothing to do with Aquascape with their system whatsoever. Aquascape is absolutely amazing. If you guys not have followed Greg Woodstock, Ed the Professor and all those people, make sure you go give them a follow. They're the ones that helped me design this absolutely massive enclosure right here for Oliver and Callie. Second off, Oliver and Callie are pregnant. Well, not Oliver, but they work together. They have their babies together and they are a family when they have their babies and they both male and female take care of their offspring when they are born. So I can't wait to see how Oliver is when he has his baby. Hopefully, he doesn't try to kill him or anything like that and become aggressive because if that happens, we're obviously gonna have to pull him. But hopefully we're able to keep Callie with the babies for the first, hopefully month before their eyes open up. The eyes open up around 14 to 18 days. Look at Callie, look at Callie, look at Callie. She's been swimming a lot slower too, which is definitely a sign that she is 100% pregnant. Look at her, look at her. The viewing panel gives us a good, good viewing of what she looks like. Look at her. 
Look at her just hanging out right here. Look at that belly, you guys. It's absolutely huge. Last time she was so skinny and nothing showed whatsoever. But this time, it is so showing right now. That is freaking insane. Look at her. Hanging out, rolling around, doing their thing. The water's not too clear right now either, obviously, because the pumps are off. Uh, we're definitely doing a water change once the pumps come back on. And it'll be crystal, crystal, crystal clear. You guys will see that update coming soon. Look at her just hanging out, doing little circles, doing otter things look at oliver diving down all the way up over here so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video here at blake's exotic anim ranch make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel like this video put your post notifications on so you guys are updated when callie has her babies and i will see you guys in the next one peace out everybody and have a good day